So WEB, Where Everybody Belongs, is a middle school transition program. We train the eighth grade eighth graders to become web leaders and the eighth graders are assigned groups of sixth graders at sixth grade orientation and they help welcome the sixth graders on campus show them around and just pretty much show them um, how to be successful in middle school yeah so the ultimate goal is just smoothly transitioning our sixth graders from that elementary into the middle school most of them if they know they've got 40 eighth graders that are there to support them, encourage them, and help them be the best they can be, we've found that they come into school so much more relaxed. Um, it's awesome to see on that first day of school, because the orientation is the day before the first day. So they get a campus tour, they get to see where all their classes are. So when they walk on campus that first day, it's amazing. They're not worried about, where's my class? Who am I gonna eat with? They've got already a connectedness to our campus and they come in relaxed and ready to learn and ready to be a Viking. So it's a really cool program in that you see the interaction. It really creates campus connectedness at our school. Okay, the program got started. I believe Webb has been running at Valley for the last 10 years, but it really got off the ground probably about four or five years ago. Yeah, every year it just seems to grow and grow. We just start implementing more activities for the eighth graders to be involved with the sixth graders. And um, every year we just look forward to an even bigger year. So every year we recruit for eighth grade web leaders. They're usually uh, either kids who the teachers will recommend, say this person would make a good one. A lot of times I teach sixth grade, so I remember a lot of kids that I think would be have the skills that it would take to be an eighth grade web leader. And ultimately, we have application process where they fill out applications, and then we go through the, all the applications and select. So they write us a letter like why they want to be a web leader, and then we go through the process of selecting them. Uh, I know in the past three years, our web leadership has grown from only like 20 to 25 kids to now every year we consistently have at least 40 kids. It's three days before school starts, they come and we do training. So. 8.30 to 12.30, we train uh, for three days, then they come in and prep, and then they come the day before school to do the orientation all day. So they really give up a lot of their time. Uh, so it's a huge commitment. For the sixth graders, the goal would be to feel connected to the campus and feel safe, be in a safe environment. It's amazing to see some of the students how you can be, as a web leader, they can do the minimum, like the basic functions we do at school, and then there's lots of opportunities to go above and beyond. And you really see some of the kids that just thrive when they're given that opportunity, and they do every little extra aspect, um, and they interact as much as they can. And so what the eighth graders learn is they learn responsibility, they learn leadership. They learn what it means to have other kids looking up at them. And they really take that to heart, and they really take, take it that seriously. Serious. One of the best parts for me would be seeing the sixth graders flood into our MU um, on sixth grade orientation day. They are so excited. They're just pumped up. And to see our web leaders high-fiving them, welcoming, welcoming them, it's just a really cool experience. The music's pumping, and there's so much energy in the room. It's just... It's really neat just to see how our eighth graders just put on this orientation and welcome all of the sixth graders on orientation day. Our, our program definitely only runs as well as it does because of our three coordinators and our wonderful staff that allows it to. Overall, I just think that WEB is a great program for kids uh, connecting with each other and supporting one another. Um, this program can be so big and we're just looking forward to it growing every single year.